to recalculate your workbook, uh, the shortcut you want to use is F9. So when do you want to recalculate your workbook, you might be asking. Well, uh, in some instances, you know, calculations will change or you, or you can update something in your in your spreadsheet and, and it doesn't hasn't calculated yet. So uh, here are a few examples of that. One, one instance is if you're using a random function. Um, like the following, this this will just produce a random number uh, between zero and one. So I'm not hitting F9, and every time I do that, it's recalculating this random number. Um, so that's that's one example. Another example is you might just have a spreadsheet that has so much uh, calculation going on in it that you don't want it to um, to recalculate every time that you make a, that you enter some information. So let's say you know. I have um, this simple formula. If I have my worksheet set up so that it's calculating automatically, then you know if I come in here and, and change this two to a four, it's going to recalculate this sum automatically as well as everything else in the worksheet. Okay, so sometimes you don't want Excel to do that because it takes too much time when there's when there's too much information. In the spreadsheet, so uh, an option that you can use if you go into alt, you use Alt T O, I'm getting some additional shortcut advice here. Um, alt T O formulas, and come down to instead of automatic calculation, if we change this to manual, okay, then what happens the next time? Let's say I change this to a two, you can see that this this sum does not change because I've I've switched my worksheet to manual. Now if I want this to recalculate I need to hit F9 and then it will recalculate the workbook. Mm -hmm.